Senator Tom Cotton visited the Trafalgar Road fire, also known as the Stump Dump Fire, for the first time this afternoon. KNWA's Kelly O'Neill in Bella Vista to show us what lawmakers are doing to help extinguish the underground fire. I want to make sure the leadership of the EPA knows that this is a high priority for me. As the smoke from the Trafalgar Road fire wafts through the air, Senator Tom Cotton, wanting to see it and smell it for himself, walked the property Friday afternoon. I have a conversation next week with the acting administrator of the EPA, so I wanted to be able to describe it uh, in detail to him and also mm -hmm. talk about the conversations I've had with our state and local experts, so make sure that it's front of mind. Cotton praising the work already done by state officials in the ADEQ, like building a trench around the underground fire says he hopes the price tag to extinguish the fire could be lowered from what Governor Asa Hutchinson estimated to be around $30 million. It's possible the federal government may have the ability to help offset some of those costs through various funds. That's one conversation we'll be having. It's probably at this stage too, uh, too preliminary, though. The findings of air quality reports from the past several weeks fluctuate from good to moderate. Most recently, reports from Bella Vista Fire Station 2 show that the air quality is good but can change based on weather and wind direction. As the best method to put out the fire is to be determined, Cotton says he'll be meeting with families who have experienced health issues as a result of the smoke, all the while continuing to monitor the site. Right now I want to make sure that public health is uh, safe. In Bella Vista, Kelly O'Neill, KNWA, Northwest Arkansas News.